Hello and welcome back to another Python tutorial. My name's Tom with LearnPythonTutorial.com and in this tutorial I'm going to um, help you folks who have trouble installing um, Python 3 from Python.org's download. Um, I know one or two uh, users did mention that they had issues. Now this is not a guarantee that this is going to work so um, I'm just attempting this for you because I really don't know what your issue is with your computer because obviously I can't get on it so um, this is just another way to install uh, Python 3 um, we're gonna use something called brew so if you don't have brew on your computer go over to brew.sh and copy this uh, command right here we're gonna put this into our terminal and this goes and downloads a uh, software package called homebrew Homebrew uh, allows us to install packages very easily onto our Macs. So again, open up your terminal, hit Command V, hit Return, and this is going to install it. Mine says it appears Homebrew is already installed on your computer. So if you get that, that means you already had Homebrew. Uh, if you didn't get that, you're going to get a download and installation, a lot more lines of code than I did here. All right. So once it's done doing that, we want to check our installation we want to run like a test code here it's a command that will run a test code I should say so we're going to do brew doctor so it's going to check our installation um, so it's going to run through a bunch of code and um, make sure everything's installed properly on your machine I'm going to pause mine until it's done doing that now I got some warnings here um, mainly about Python 3 being installed on my computer because um, it's saying, hey, we didn't install this and the path's not correct. I'm not going to change mine because I'm, I'd rather use the python.org software versus brew. And that's just my preference. But I got some warnings. So yours is going to look different than mine looks, but that's okay. Um, so now we ran brew doctor and you don't have any crazy warnings because if you just download it, you shouldn't have any warnings. Um, but if you do then you're gonna have to google um, and read through Bruce documentation like here it tells me to uh, prune the skip the sim links that that's something you may have to do um, I'm not going to do that because I know mine set up properly next thing we want to do is brew update and this will update all the um, software from brew or software you, that you installed using brew so let's go ahead and run that Mine's going to kick back everything's up to date here in a second. All right, already up to date. So, good. Next thing we want to do, next command we want to do is install Python 3. To do that, we're going to do brew install Python 3, just like that. I'm not going to hit return because I don't want to install another Python 3 on my machine because then the path is screwy and I don't know what I'm working with. But for you, it's... Go ahead and install this because obviously you're watching this video because you haven't installed Python 3 or it hasn't worked for you. So go ahead and hit brew install Python 3 and it's going to install the Python 3 uh, software on your computer. Once it has done that, um, we're going to go ahead and do Python 3 like this or Python. Um, depending on how you, your computer set up, it's either Python 3 or Python. Try 3 first. Um, if that doesn't work, then just try Python. Um, normally, if you just type in Python, you're going to get this, the default Python software on your computer, which is Python 2.7 on a Mac. Um, if that uh, works, great. But um, normally, you got to use Python 3. So I'm going to hit Python 3. And now we're in the Python uh, interactive interpreter that's what I was looking for the Python interpreter um, so mine says Python 3.5.1 that is the latest version of Python and hopefully yours says that sometimes a brew they're like one version behind so it might say Python 3.5.0 great if you get this here you got Python 3 on your computer um, if you did not get that uh, your paths might be a little screwy so if um, your paths a little screwed up you uh, have to go into your path and adjust the path to 
this right here, export path, this whole thing right here. So I would, when you ran Brew Doctor, it will kick this back to you if it's if your path's not correct. Um, if you don't know how to change this, just Google um, change Mac path, and you will get an explanation of how to actually change this. I can't show you because I don't want to mess with my path. So um, I hope this helps. Uh, I know I couldn't go through the whole tutorial with you because I already have it installed on my computer and I'm in the process of moving so my desktop is packed away so uh, otherwise I would have done it on there. So if you have any questions let me know. Um, I'll try to help you out. If not, you know, good and jump into our tutorials and we'll teach you Python 3. Uh, don't forget to like the video, don't forget to share it and we'll see you in the next one.